Hey there, friends. Got a TTG reaction for you with Sidekick. Sorry, Titans. No time to What's with the suitcases, Robin? All right. Peace. Everybody's right. chilling. I'm heading out now on classified work. No questions, please. I, I, I think you want everyone to know. Everybody there's just chilling. I, I love Starfire's bored face. She's like, <laughs> It's top, top, tippity top secret. All right, bro. Just go already. Nobody cares. <laughs> Ew. Bro looking like one of those pea shooters from... From Plants vs. Zombies. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong, though. Tell me I'm wrong. He do be looking like a pea shooter. <laughs> Ew. So, where are you going, Robin? <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you? It's top secret. Top. It's okay. top secret. Bye. It's top secret. Have fun. <laughs> if you need me, I'll just be at the bat cave. Hey, yo, wait, what? Can I come? Oh. He's hanging around here. Oh, hold on a second. So that's the reason why he's like, oh, the tippity top secret. So wait, are we gonna see the Batcave in this show? That actually sounds really awesome. I mean, it sounds much better than what they were doing on the couch. Can I come? What about Can I come? Oh, now he's a celebrity. I'm the only one Batman trusts on this super important mission. Yo! Okay, you are kidding me. You're telling me that they actually gave... That they actually gave Robin one of the coolest, like, exits with that motor... With that suitcase turning into a motorcycle right there. That's actually really sick. Besides, you Titans are needed here. Whoa. Whoa. So motorcycle Monday! Oh, okay. Okay, that was actually sick. They actually gave Robin, like, an awesome moment right there. Him acting like a celebrity to his friends because, you know, he's going to the Batcave, but we're actually going to see the Batcave. That's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to see what it looks like. I love that real-looking moon. <laughs> Robin. Huh? Robin. Yeah. <clears throat> Boy Wonder. Oh, Wars that worked. Activated. Boy Wonder. <laughs> Wait, did, did the machine just laugh? <laughs> I mean, I so what I know that you know Robin used to be Batman's sidekick, and that's the you know that's the reason why the episode was called Sidekick, and. Batman and Robin used to work together. They had a bunch of movies, a bunch of shows done. There were many iterations of Robins. And Robin used to be called the Boy Wonder. So it's really funny that Robin had to use the Boy Wonder to get in. Like, even Batman doesn't recognize it. Robin? Who's Robin? You're the Boy Wonder. Ooh, hold on a second. Wait, we got the... You see that Batcopter? What's that Batcopter? Why does it have a mouth? We got the Joker card, the Bats, the Batman Skellington, the Batman robot, the giant pen. Did, did Batman always have a giant penny in his cave? Ooh, like this place looks really nice though. Giant dinosaur, that weird goop creature and everything. Having, having an underground like secret lair, that is insane though also it must be nice and cold down there which is definitely my kind of temperature all right let's get to work so what does robin gotta do oh there's a bunch of villains the dcu book robin what a mustache so we got the blue beetle 
Save Young Justice? Aquaman, Fishmel, Chilling with the Fishes, and Space Ghost. What the heck? There's so many references, though. Is he just chilling on the internet? What's this? Dear Boy Wonder. <laughs> Thanks for cave sitting. Help yourself to some juice. XOXO Batman. But if, oh, oh, oh. He got followed? <laughs> of course he got followed. But the thing is, did you see the Batman logo on the bottom right, though? It was loading. The logo had to load, which means that Batman's internet is not really that fast. Batman, you're, you're pretty much like the richest man, one of the richest men in the world. Get some better internet, bro. Oh, snap. Juice. Yeah, what? Sup, guys? How did you get in the Batcave? Passed all the alarms and sensors and booby traps. You left the door open. Great job, Robin. This was an important mission. Ooh. This is an important mission. Is that the crime alert? No. It's time to feed the fish. The no, fish? No, must act fast. R r oh, okay. So I take it that Robin is house sitting. Also, why did I pause in that moment? That is a really awkward frame to pause on. Where's everybody staring? But I do love the references like Batman's wallpaper. You get to see enemies like Catwoman, I believe, Bane, the Penguin, Scarecrow, Two Face, Harley Quinn, the Man Bat, I believe. I know there's Batman and Man Bat. And is that the head of Dr. Freeze on the left? Are they, are there fish where Batman cut? Oh my, that's so cute. That's freaking adorable. <laughs> oh, for real? What is with the oh. short shorts? Oh my goodness. Why does Robin got such a big head though? <laughs> come on, come on, come on. You can't be in here. Oh my I goodness. I orders from Batman. Don't worry, bro. We'll leave. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm noticing another... What's Renew You? And also on the... Wait, on the top right near the picture of Batman and Robin. Robin 2? Was that a past Robin that, that's in that urn right now? But first, let's check this place out. Oh. Beast back. Just ignore him, guys. Hey, Raven made some friends. All the batarangs. Ooh. Whoa! Now hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Starfire and Batwoman's costume? Batgirl's costume, I mean, but... Wait, why does Batman have a Batgirl costume? Anyway. So, remember the future episode about responsibilities and everything, and Robin ends up with Batgirl? Do you think... It's because of Starfire doing this is the reason why he likes Batgirl. Because Batgirl reminds him of the time of the time Starfire wore Batgirl's costume. <laughs> Bro! But the costume is too tight to remove. Oh, oh, don't, don't oh. Bro! Calm down. He is. Thirsty as heck for what's going on right now. It's like, you're so tight. Oh my goodness. Uh, to be honest, I am surprised they let that in, especially with the costume is too tight to remove and Robin, like, ser seriously thirsting over what is going on right now. Oh, robot fight. Who wins, real or robot? <laughs> no, no, no! That is not a toy. It looks it's like a toy. Dinosaur robot. Of course, it's a toy. Dang. Oh wait, that looks like a very special batarang right there. But the thing is, you know that when Beast Boy was fighting with the robot T Rex, the robot T Rex's head was getting busted. But at the same time, Beast Boy doesn't really have a brain, so he's not really losing much to begin with. So either way, if you try to beat Beast Boy in a headbanging contest, of course Beast Boy would win. There's no, there's nothing he can lose. 
He's a dum dum boy. And I love him for it. The ultimate battering. Oh, sick. What makes it so ultimate? <laughs> oh. No one is allowed to touch the <laughs> ultimate battering. This is Batman's most prized possession. If anything happened to it, he'd kill me. Now let is that really the most prized possession? Not like the the Batmobile or what else would he have? Alfred? I consider Alfred a most pr prized possession. Just... Did they? Wow! They really just took that. Here. Oh, I'm so, so sorry, so, 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 so sorry, Batman. I leave you in charge for one day, and what do you do? I oh my goodness. Whenever we hear Robin scream like that, if there's like a red background and everything, if you hear glass breaking and stuff like that, yeah, Robin is gonna go ballistic. And now he's imagining the scenario Batman found out, going all crazy again. Didn't mean to let you down. What are we going to do with him, Alfred? Alfred? Well, Alfred. Uh, Alfred. Just give me another chance. <laughs> What? Did he really just? He really had Alfred, and then he had he had he he had himself as Batman, slap himself as Robin. Robin, dude, you okay? Oh he my goodness! <laughs> Why are you so scared of Batman anyway? He's the richest man in the Was world. I scared? Come on, me? No way. I think it's because Batman used to be your boss, so you still do whatever he says. It's not like that at all. We're peers now. We work together side by side. Okay, that was actually sick. Like I said, I do like it when they try to change up the art style, even if you, if it is more simple for stuff like that, though. But the thing is, who wouldn't be scared of Batman? The man with all the money, the technology, the power? Yeah, that, that all that money got him that way. He is, he is someone not to be messed with. You mean you're a sidekick? I am nobody's oh. sidekick. Yet you ride in a sidecar. Wait, that's so cute. The little Robin sidecar. <laughs> what? This episode is filled with so many details. What the heck? On a side note, you should grow some sideburns. Or go see a sideshow. Oh, would you like a side of the fries with that? I do. Oh, I so would. Because you're just saying side a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I know. We're so hilarious. I, th I think Cyborg's like, oh yeah, we are hilarious. Don't forget to watch our show every week, you know? Do, 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 do. <laughs> I can, like, I can tell when the show just makes fun of itself a lot and... This is like one of those moments right there. Oh? Oh my goodness! Is it actually something serious? Wait, so Batman also deals with the Hive? I thought the Hive was a Teen Titans thing. Or maybe Batman sees what the Hive is doing and he's like, ah, oh, I'll let the Teen Titans handle it. If he's ever in the cave. Think we should? Definitely should. Ooh, should. the, the should. ultimate batarang. Yeah, they're taking it. But the thing is, Starfire in the Batgirl outfit. Let's go. Not the ultimate yes, the ultimate batarang. Ooh, they're going in the Batmobile. I love that Raven's got like bat friends over here. Like they consider him, like they consider each other chill that they're hanging out with each other. I freaking love that though. But for the hive, they're bringing every single weapon that Batman has at his disposal though. I mean, might as well, right? <laughs> Let's see how Ooh, all right, Starfire. Nice. That's sick. So what's the hive doing this time? They're going to blow up a radio tower. I see that Commissioner Gordon put up the bat signal. Or somebody did. Or maybe Batman is hanging out with Commissioner Gordon 
in the police car just laughing it up again going <laughs> Wait, wait, can we just, can we just, can we just go back a bit? Hold on, I just saw something. Yeah, did that, did he just fly down on his eyeball? What, can he, can he do that? Can he fly down, can he inflate his eyeball and use it as a balloon? What if you pop it? Oh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> what are they doing with Batman stuff? Th that was it. It just knocked him out. <laughs> I mean, he's just tossing them. Are they really that expensive, though? If they get used, might as well, might as well just, you know, he can just buy more, make more. Is it really that much of a problem, Robin? Come on. <laughs> oh. <laughs> two, three, four. Where's the fifth one? Wait, I love how sharp one, two, they are. Where's the fifth one? Ah, oh. Ah, there you are. Come to Papa. Dang, they're so sharp. Oh. Dang. Okay, the bat the Batmobile is taking some serious damage though. But the thing is. I've seen, have you ever seen like those knives or whatever, like special, like bat, batarang, like special knife things that I remember seeing those in the past where it's like, oh yeah, it's a, uh, it's a bat. It's actually a batarang, but it's also very sharp and I don't think it can be tossed, but I think like a knife pops out of it or something like it's like, it looks really cool, but that thing is so sharp. You would actually just like, imagine having a batarang that looks like that super sharp. Easily get cut. Ow. He'll buff right out, right? He'll buff right out. Oh. Look at that. The bats are doing their work. Wait, what? What? Come on. Raven was chilling with her new friends over here, and you just told him to go back home? The, what's the worst that can happen? Like, if, if Batman notices a bat died, is that a bad thing right there? Is that a bat thing? Is it a bat thing if a bat dies right there? Bat death? They really gave Starfire the best stuff. Oh. Well, the cape got burned. Not so fast. <laughs> but, bro! Bro, you broke it! Robin, you broke the, the, the. What was the point of that? Now he's just being a jerk right now. Robin's just being a grade A jerk. He just broke that thing just to make. Okay. Oh. Seems like so. Think I got most of them back. A little luck. He'll never notice. By the way, that. But wait, that's the that's the batarang cannon. I'm like, wait, why is that batarang so huge? But look at all those weapons, though. Oh, where is the ultimate batarang? They've got it. That, that thing is it. huge. Because Batman would kill me. Oh. Well, it looks like it's the end of the Teen Titans right there. But yeah, what would make it ultimate though? Is it a big bomb? Usually? I don't know. But Robin, out of all your craziness, you let the hive end up with the ultimate batarang. You were just too crazy that you wow, okay, cool. Great job. Oh wait, what? Ooh, wait. Excuse me? That's the secret weapon. It's a light show? Yeah. What would Batman use that for? Last Tuesday. You're kidding me. The ultimate battle rank is just the ultimate light show right there. The, also, why does Batman look like that, though? He's got the longest face I've ever seen, though. The difference between the photo with him and Robin to now is 
insanely different. I mean, I get it, it's a parody show, so in this one, Batman's more of a joke character. But still, it's really funny to just see him like that going... <laughs> And suddenly I'm a little less scared of Batman. Oh, wow. This is going to be fun. Okay, I get it, though. I get it. D Wait, what? That thing just ate him up like a Pac-Man. But the thing is, it's good to know that Robin can actually have fun with the weapons now, but... At the same time, you're gonna let your friends stay tied up. You're not gonna let them loose and let them have fun too. Robin, you're just you're just taking all the fun for yourself. Oh. Wait, was that the Robin? The Hold on, we got. Yeah, was that the freaking Batman knuckle duster? The Batman brass knuckles, the bat knuckles, the backles. Those were the big old backles right there. Well, great job, Robin. Wow, every, hold on, wait, there was more stuff at the end. I wanted to see that. The bat first aid kit, the bat sock, the bat prototypes, the bat surfboard, the bat pizza, the bat shorts. What? I haven't seen the bat nuclear waste, the bat waste. Where's the bat waste? Yeah, it's all gone. Huh, maybe Batman won't notice. At the same time, with the way we've seen him, would he even care? Would he even be mad at Robin for what he did? I mean, the thing is, if you told Robin to bats at your cave and this all happens, if, yeah, 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 I can see him being mad, but... Yeah. Are you going to be okay? We could stay with you as you speak to the Batman. No. It's time I man up and tell him I am not a sidekick anymore. I'm not going to water his plants or feed his fish. Wait, the fish are dead. Bro, I think Batman will be mad about that too. It's like Robin didn't do a single thing that Batman asked for. I mean, I get if, like, some weapons are used and, you know, the things are destroyed and whatnot, but the fish are freaking dead! What the heck, dude? Do you know what I am? Do you think I like seeing stuff like that? There's something about Robin and Fish using dead fish to make that Aquaman costume, and now this? Is there something with Robin and Fish that he doesn't like? Does he not like me? We, I, this is why I'm not, I'm not going near him at all. I mean, seriously, just sprinkle it in. Batman is about to learn that from now on, he is not the boss of me. All right. Oh, what's up, Batman? I didn't mean it, Batman. I'll clean all this up. Please don't be mad. Please, please. Dude. Wow. Uh, who am I kidding? The, the jo- What? Okay. And it's not like Batman has surveillance cameras in his cave to see like they actually that Robin actually did all this stuff. But no, 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 that's fine. So the Joker did it, and it'll give Robin the, the Batman a reason to go up to Joker once again. Ah, Batman, I didn't ruin your cave. What are you talking about? <laughs> you know, something like that. It'll, it'll probably go like that. But this was a pretty cool episode, full of references, full of details. It just goes to show that even though that. The creators do make fun of the Teen Titans and DC stuff a lot, but they do understand the source material with all the details, you know, with the Boy Wonder, the villains, and the the urn containing Robin 2's ashes? That's actually really dark, that. Yeah. I wonder how many people actually caught that, though. That's actually really dark. But either way, fun stuff, though. The, we got some fan service stuff with Starfire as Batgirl, and I take it that's the reason why Nightwing likes Batgirl, because it reminded him of the time when Starfire wore that Batgirl costume. It all matches up perfectly. But in the end, Batman is a goofball, so... The ultimate Batarang became a party rank, of course. What a twist, I guess. But it was really cool seeing everybody you know, try out all the Batman stuff. 
we basically got like the fan servicey Batman episode where I don't know. It was really cool though. It was really cool. Hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't, comment about what you think in the comments below, and I'll catch you next time. I'm not forgiving Robin for killing the fish though. Never.